If we could take a seat. Good morning, Rosa Parks. Good morning. Good morning. Let's get our peace signs up. Great job, everyone. Take a seat and let's get our peace signs up, please. Thank you. Switch over to our quiet coyotes. Great job. All right, we have a lot of guests here today, so we're going to show off our wonderful, thunderous Thursday waterfall goes. Wow, what a great job, Rosa Parks. Thank you so much. That was an awesome drill. Really appreciate all the cooperation. Everyone was safe, kind, respectful, and responsible as they did the drill and exited the building, so I want to just thank everyone for that. This is a special day today. This is our 30th anniversary of our last big earthquake here in the Bay Area. Just to let the younger people here know, I was a freshman in college. Uh, thinking about this, watching my San Francisco Giants World Series game about to start at home when this earthquake happened 30 years ago. So now fast forward, we're having this drill. This is the 11th year of our great shakeout, and you all are a part of it today where we have many guests. So first up, I'm going to introduce Dr. Vincent Matthews, our superintendent for San Francisco Unified School District. Thank you. Good, good morning, boys and girls. J just want to tell you how proud I am of you today. You did exactly what you were supposed to do during an earthquake. You dropped, you covered, you made sure your head was covered, and then when you heard the all clear sign, you came out here. That's exactly what you're supposed to do. We want to make sure you are safe during an earthquake. And one more thing we want you to do is make sure you are telling your parents to be prepared. So make sure they have all of the things you need, food, batteries, flashlight, uh, first aid kit, uh, water. You want to have all those things and a plan. So make sure you're telling your parents that. So I'm very proud of you today. I want you to, we're going to do a quick cheer. I'm going to spell good job, G-O-O-D-J-O-B, because you did such a good job. So I'm going to say G-O-O-D-J-O-B, and then you say good job, good job. G-O-O-D-J-O-B. Good job, One more time. G-O-O-D-J-O-B. You did an excellent job today, and I'm so proud of you. Give yourselves a big round of applause. We have many people here who are uh, charged with keeping you safe. We have the uh, chief of emergency, the Department of Emergency Services. We have our police chief. We have our sheriff here. Uh, we have our fire chief here. And we have the woman who every night, all she does, she can't sleep because she's thinking about how to make your lives better. That is our wonderful mayor. And I'd like to introduce to you, and you're going to give her a big round of applause, our mayor, Mayor London Breed. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, Rosa Parks. First of all, I want to thank Ms. Tarif and her class for hosting us this morning. We had a wonderful job, a, a wonderful time. And some of you might know that I actually went to Rosa Parks Elementary School. So when I was your age, I was here. 
And this is where I first learned about what to do if there's an earthquake or any other event. My teachers at the time taught us to drop, cover, and now it's hold on, but it was drop and cover back then. But it's still, the point is to still keep you all safe. So I am excited to be here today to celebrate what we know is 30 years of the Loma Prieta earthquake. Now I know all of you weren't born back then, but I was. And I was a freshman in high school. And I remember that time and the lessons that I learned when I was at Rosa Park Elementary School as a teenager, I applied those same lessons and they did not disappoint. We know that it's not a matter of if an earthquake is gonna happen in San Francisco, it's a matter of when. And so you all are the ambassadors to make sure that your families know what to do. So what do we do? Number one. Number two. Number three. Yes, you guys are the ambassadors. Good job, good job. And ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to introduce the department that keeps you all safe, our new Fire Chief Janine Nicholson. Good morning, Rosa Parks. Can we do that a little louder? You all are awesome. And uh, I just, I don't, I don't want to brag, but my table in your classroom, we rocked it. We rocked it. <laughs> So um, everything that Mayor Breed said is correct, and uh, we want you all to be prepared so that we don't have to come and help you. Of course, we will if we have to, but we want you all to be prepared and bring th this message home to your families so you all can take care of yourselves. And just like today, when we did this in a team, right, and you always have a buddy at school, the fire department, we always do everything in a team. So make sure you're taking care of your neighbor and, uh, and um, your friends, and uh, we'll be there to take care of you as well. And I would like to introduce uh, the head of our Department of Emergency Management who oversees all of the city and taking care of all of you folks, Mary Ellen Carroll. Good morning, Rosa Parks. I am so impressed about how much you all know about earthquakes, because my job is all about getting ready for earthquakes, and you all know so much. And then I have a secret for you I want to share. I think you know more than most of the adults around here. So what I want you to do is make sure when you go home that you talk to your parents and your friends and anybody who's an adult and make sure you teach them what you know about earthquakes. Great job, you guys. One other thing, do you know the phone number that you are supposed to call if you have? <laughs> you guys are too smart. 911, 911 is the number you call if you need a police officer or a firefighter. So I'm really glad that you know that and make sure that if you ever are in an emergency, you can call that and the people that work for me are the ones that answer that number and they'll be here. So thank you so much for having us. You did a great job. Share all of your great knowledge that's in your head. And now I'm gonna introduce someone to you who's very important and he is our chief of police. His name is Bill Scott. So let's welcome Chief Scott. Good morning. So we're going to have a little fun. I'm going to be really, really quick. But I want you all to teach the whole city of San Francisco what you did this morning. And we want the whole city to hear us. So we have to be really, really loud, OK? All right, let's try that again. We've got to be really, really loud, OK? OK, so on three. We're going to tell the whole city how to handle an earthquake, and that's to drop, cover, and hold on. So on three, we want the whole city to hear us. Are you ready? Okay, one, two, three. I think the whole city heard us. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much.
So now I want to introduce another one of our public safety partners, our sheriff, Sheriff Vicki Hennessy. All right, you guys. Everybody said, say good morning. And I want you guys to say good morning to me, the loudest of anybody here. Can we do that? One, two, three, good morning. <laughs> yeah. That was great. Thank you so much. And I just want to do a shout out to the kindergarten class. I had Zen at my table, I had Willow at my table, and I had and I had Jesse at my table. And they were so quick getting under that table and dropping, covering, and holding on that I just had to give a shout out. And they're in kindergarten, so I can't imagine how everybody in the rest of the school did. I'm sure you did wonderfully. So once again, thank you for letting us come today and talk to you, and thank you for the work you're doing to keep yourselves safe and your families safe by telling your parents today what happened. Thank you. Thank you all. Can we give one last great big Rosa Parks hand for all of our guests today? And I think we will end with one more last good job, good job. Let's hear it. Good job. Oh, I got Dr. Matthews got to do it. Here we go. You ready? G double O D J O B. I said G double O D J O B. Thank you, Rosa Parks. You are dismissed. Kinders first, them first.